Rarity, Starlight and I kind of need your help. Oh, oh, I'm afraid I can't just now. Twilight will be here any moment for her fitting. Oh, that's why we're here. Spike and I are putting together something special for the coronation. Oh, darling, we're all putting together something for the coronation. Be thankful you are not doing the gown. This is my 14th version. This is different. It's from all of us, and it's kind of about all of us, too. I combined some ancient spells to make a magical scrapbook, and now all we need is some memories to go inside. That way, Twilight can have a collection of memories to look at anytime she wants. All we need you to do is... Rarity, it's Twilight. Are you sure we need to do another fitting? I don't think my sizes have changed. Ah, did we mention we wanted to be a surprise? My Little Pony, My Little Pony Faithful and strong, sharing kindness. It's an easy feat, and magic makes it all complete. You have mine. Do you know you are my very best friends? We want to be sure to get some of Twilight's own memories, so just get her talking about old times with you. I'll do the rest. We get it, Starlight. You're good at magic. I thought maybe you weren't home. Not home, darling. I would never miss a fitting. Of course not. And I really appreciate you being so generous with your time. But are all these fittings really necessary? But, darling, the perfect fit is imperative. And as for my time, well, I am far from the most generous pony in Equestria. Actually, that's exactly what you are. <laughs> What a world! What a world! Excuse me, sir. Why are you crying? Well, I don't know. I was just sitting here, minding my own business, when this tacky little cloud of purple smoke just whisked past me and tore half of my beloved mustache clean off. And now I look simply horrid. Oh! Oh, give me a break. That's what all the fuss is about? Why, of course it is! How can you be so insensitive? Oh, just look at him. Such lovely luminescent scales. I know. And your expertly quaffed mane. Oh, I know, I know. Yes, your fabulous manicure. <gasps> it's so true. Oh, ruined without your beautiful mustache. It's true, I'm hideous. I simply cannot let such a crime against fabulosity go uncorrected. Oh! What did you do that for? Rarity, what are you... and amazing. You do something nice for some pony, and then you never know when they'll do something nice for you. So then you can do something nice for us. Like get us in to see any of the hills. Which is only the best musical in all of Equestria. They must be good if Rainbow Dash is impressed. Normally she doesn't even like musicals. I know. Ponies just bursting into song in random places at the drop of a hat. Who does that? Oh, Manhattan, what you do to me? a huge bustling community and there's always opportunity to do the friendly thing if some are grouchy pay no mind surprise instead with something kind lo and behold you may just find a smile is what you bring welcome to the main fair hotel please allow me to 
to take those bags to your room for you. Only if you'll accept this gratuity first. Oh, 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 I'll get you changed. Do keep it all. I insist. Generosity, I'm here to show off. Some may say, rarity, don't be so big-hearted and bold. Treating strangers like their friends, this town's too big and cold. But this is how I play my cards, I'm not about to fold. Where I see a frown, I go to town, call me the Oh, Manhattan, what you do to us? What if you find a gloomy girl? It's no intimidating thing. Just be kind without a fuss. Generosity, I'm here to show all that I can do. Generosity, you are the key. Manhattan, I'm here. Suppose I've had my generous moments. Although, I haven't always been perfect. Twilight, sew these pieces together according to that pattern there. You said if we skipped dinner at the Farfield Tavern, you'd order a meal for us to eat while we keep working. Don't fret. It'll be here in an hour. That's not going to be a problem, is it? Well, we're supposed to be watching any of the hills by then. Oh, I see. I go out of my way to get you tickets for a show, and this is how you repay me? By abandoning me in my hour of need? see any of the hills tonight. And then tomorrow morning, when you come to see my fashion show without any fashion to show, you can have more entertainment. <gasps> oh, why, look, there's our friend Rarity going down in flames. Isn't friendship magic? Rarity, calm down. What's gotten into you? What's gotten into you? Oh, go ahead, see your little show. Congratulations, fillies. Sounds like you've all figured out already it's every pony for herself in this town. the last of them. <laughs> Finally! You're welcome! The Applewood Derby! <laughs> of course I'll help! Wow, uh, Rarity, I didn't know you'd be this excited. Me? Oh, why, I'm just itching to write an old wrong from long, long ago. I designed my own cart when I was just a filly, and I was positive I was going to win the prize for most creative hooves down. But I came in second. Second! You? Second for most creative? To whom? <laughs> but I learned a valuable lesson. I learned to know my audience, and the race card audience was big. They were bold! Chop, chop! Every pony out! We've got work to do! This will take all of my considerable skills. <laughs> but I will fashion the biggest and boldest derby card to ever win the prize for most creative. Actually, I was sort of thinking of something more traditional. <laughs> oh, please, darling, leave tradition to the apples. We drink big, we drink bold. <laughs> Soon the prize for most creative will finally be in my hooves. You mean my hooves? Yes, that's what I said, my hooves. Okay, so I sketched out some of my ideas. How about a nice yellow fringe on top? Oh, darling. The fringe is not exactly big. And 
that yellow is the least bold color I can imagine. Well, it doesn't have to be yellow, but I really do love the old-timey style, like this. Sweetie Belle, precious face, old-timey is just another word for passé. Remember big and bold. I do have a reputation to uphold. It was one thing to lose as a filly, but can you imagine if I didn't win the most creative now? Ponies might stop buying my couture. But we're supposed to be doing this together. Yes, of course we are, darling. In fact, we just finished. <laughs> I know, you're speechless. But if that isn't big and bold, I don't know what is. Isn't it wonderful? <laughs> <sighs> right. Wonderful. I was expecting an audience with the princess, not outdoor sport. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> Welcome to your lucky day, Rarity. You found the one thing in Equestria that could rival my face for sheer beauty. What do you think you like? Shan't succumb to such fabulousness. But get to the center to meet the others. <laughs> well, Rarity, it took forever, but it was worth it. Who knew three little gemstones would turn out to be this handsome hunk of a diamond? Now to get you home. <laughs> Are we glad to see? Why are you carrying a humongous boulder? What do you mean, boulder? This big, beautiful, bedazzling rock is a diamond! And it's all mine. Keep your envious little eyes off it! I found it and it's mine, fair and square! Maybe those weren't your best moments but I can't think of a single pony who's never made a mistake. Whoa! What was that? My little pony, my little pony. Is there some pony else here? No, I mean, yes. Well, not exactly. You see, I asked that delightful family of raccoons from my shop in Manhattan to help out. Ha <laughs> ha! Well, where were we? Uh, ah, oh, yes, it's so nice to have the chance to reminisce. Every pony's so busy with the coronation. Still can't believe it's happening. <laughs> you really are an inspiration to ponies everywhere. I suppose so. But honestly, you've always been an inspiration to me. Me? Whatever for? Are you kidding? You basically built a fashion empire from scratch. This is the most whimsical and wonderfully fashionable boutique I've ever seen. In the end, Rarity's grand opening was a smashing success. True, it got off to a rocky start, but somehow this ragtag group of ne'er-do-wells, oh, heavens, I think he means you, came together and created the perfect boutique, a vision of Rarity combined with the expertise of her friends. <laughs> this reporter, for one, is a believer. Why didn't you tell me there were so many problems? We all figured you had enough on your mind. And we didn't want you to think that the opening wasn't perfect. <laughs> Ne'er-do-wells or not, I know I can always count on all of you. And nothing could be more perfect than that. I appreciate hearing how much I'm appreciated. <laughs> of course I appreciate you. And <laughs> I'm definitely not the only one. <sighs> You've been very patient today, Spike. And for that, you get the finest reward. This is from me to you. Is something wrong, Spike? No. It's perfect. Spike, it is very noble of you Shh. to sacrifice the gem Rarity gave you. Oh, Lady Rarity, 
My damsel in distress, I shall save you. Show yourselves, you dogs, you curs! <laughs> Now, where is Lady Rarity? <gasps> Spike! I knew you would save me! Nothing could stop me, my lady. Oh, Spike, you are my hero. Mm. Oh, there, lover boy. Um, Applejack? Is it against the rules to trade names? Like if I had a better idea for some pony special? I mean, specific? If you can figure out who has the pony you want and they're okay with trading, I guess it's fine. Great! So, uh, who do you... I don't have rarity. What? That's not who I... Uh-huh. Pinky! <laughs> Whoa! Oh! <laughs> How's your shopping going, Spike? Uh, fine. Which pony did you get? I can't remember. I've got Applejack, darling. She's going to adore her present. There's a brilliant designer in Manhattan, Fedora Felt, who makes the most marvelous hats. I asked for a new take on Western Chic that would be the envy of every farm pony in Equestria. That's a great gift, Rarity. I hope I can find something for my pony as special as you are. She is. Uh, bye. <laughs> Hey, Fluttershy. Thinking of getting that for your heartwarming helper? Mm-hmm. She loves shiny things. I wish I knew what my secret pony wanted. She's so hard to shop for. Oh, no. Maybe I could help. Unless you don't want to... Rainbow Dash. Oh, I was just talking to Rainbow Dash about this. Great idea. We should trade ponies. Wait, trade? Well, Applejack said it's not against the rules, and you know what Rainbow Dash likes, so it's perfect. <gasps> Rarity? What a surprise! <laughs> Thanks! Over the years, my relationship with Spike has changed, but it will always be very special. Ow! It sounds like those raccoons need help. We should check and make sure the raccoons are okay. No! I mean, no, you can't move. Uh, for the fitting, you see, if you start to move too much, then we'll have to do it all over again. <laughs> so, I, uh, I will go and check on my animal assistants. What exactly are you doing back here? Surely you have enough memories by now. Uh, almost? Now, where were we? I must say, I'm quite enjoying this fitting. I may not be the ruler of Equestria, but it is nice to hear how I've inspired ponies with my meager talent for fashion. <laughs> oh, come on, Rarity. Of course you have a knack for design, but you're a lot more than that. But I should take it from here. You castle guards have such a difficult job. I'm guessing that at times it can be rather boring. It is. I've counted all 345 bolts in the ceiling tiles 293 times. And of course, being a castle guard can be thankless work. I'm not saying you did, but if you took a break, you more than deserved it. Uh, you're right. We don't get a lot of recognition for what we do. Except for last night when some pony was nice enough to leave a cake for us. So we did take one little break when we ate that cake. What kind of cake was it? Cherry with a custard filling? Was the frosting vanilla or chocolate? Chocolate. Was the base of the cake decorated with buttercream rosettes? It was. Ugh! Who cares how it was decorated? Rainbow Dash was questioning my methods, but I knew what I was doing. Music is very relaxing! Sure. Mm. Oh, much better. Because when you have to protect yourself, you don't have time for any pony else. Too bad you never taught that in school. Huh? Uh. Rarity, are you okay? Uh, of course I 
am. It's just lovely to hear when a friend thinks highly of you. <clears throat> All right, uh, looks like they... I have everything I need. Really? Are you sure you'll be able to finish this dress in time? Oh, oh, that's not your coronation gown. <laughs> I finished that weeks ago. What? It's gorgeous, but what is this? That is a backup. One can never be too careful when it comes to a coronation. I like to have all of my bases covered. Add that to the list of things I'll never forget about you, Rarity. Oh. 